Samsung Note 20 More Surprise Features Samsung is really doing a good job I never thought of such surprise Galaxy Note 20 family because most of the stuff is based on the Galaxy S20 but nonetheless it is here the first ever benchmark league of the Galaxy Note 20 plus 5G model this is a Geekbench 5 result and looking at the scores they're actually pretty impressive 985 single core score and 3220 multi core score these numbers are actually much better than what I get on my Exynos 990 Galaxy S20 Ultra however I'm pretty sure that the Esther.30 Ultra with Exynos 990 can score higher there must be some kind of optimization regarding this application but the scores are pretty good at first we just had the scores but developer Max Weinbach actually went inside and he stumbled upon something absolutely surprising so this code has revealed that the maximum clock speed for this chip is at 3.09 GHz which is much higher than the 2.84 GHz frequency of the normal sniper you can age 65 which led us to believe that this is the Qualcomm age 65 plus now is always the model number for this device ended with a USM and 986U model which means this is for the United States Canada and China where we see the significant devices once again it's gonna make other people disappointed but wait since this is rock and snap ring and air 65 plus possibly this could actually mean that we're gonna see the next version of the Exynos chip as well in fact Sam Samsung is already working on the Exynos version of the Galaxy Note 2 Plus with the model number Rockin SMN986B. All these model numbers ending with a B means that these are the Exynos model as I've seen with my S20 Ultra FS model number is also ending with the B. So from there I can definitely say that it is the Exodus model now because we have this snapper again age 65 plus for the U model we can expect Exynos 995 CPU with a bit higher clock speed or some other improvements to come with the international version this will bring us one step closer to the Exynos 1000 that eventually see on the Galaxy S21 possibly with a MD GPU that chip would most likely have 5 nanometer process in order to compete with Apple because Apple is already doing that with this year's iPhones with Apple in 14 so snap regain your 65 plus is a great news even though Samsung is still using Exynos there's a bright side to it which means a better Exynos processor could be on its way now judging from the model number SMN 986 it's definitely the Galaxy Note 20 plus model the Geekbench listing show it edgy got a ramp or this phone this kind of follows the same thing that Samsung did with the Galaxy S20 Plus and the S20 in regions where there is no 5 grams so these models are actually rocking a GB RAM instead of 12 I'm pretty sure that 5G versions will have targets of RAM but yeah here it shows a GB of RAM and since this is the Note 20 Plus model there's definitely going to be in Note 20 Ultra for that model the model number could be SM Plus 990 which is a one digit above the SM and 989 of the Galaxy S20. Ultra. Again very soon the software will confirm whether we see two variants of the Galaxy Note 2 family or three versions of that it's gonna be very exciting let me know your thoughts on the S65 plus now I have another theory for you guys Qualcomm has showed off the prototype for that bigger in display finger scanner that is also capable of registering two fingers at the same time I would love to see that on the Note 20 family honestly the penguin scanner on the S20 Ultra is one of my least favorite things about it I think it's gonna be a great addition if Samsung saying somehow brings that to the Note 20 model now my good news for the Galaxy Fold users you are going to get the One UI 2.1 update pretty soup and all the features such as improved night mode the single tank pro video mode and quick shares among other stuff it's all coming so great news for you guys the Galaxy Note 9 recently revealed the April software patch and it still not have the One UI 2.1 update which means Samsung could bring this later down the year or they might not bring it at all we're not sure at the moment but yeah that's all the latest news we have on the Galaxy Note 20 the development is happening I'm very excited to see how much Samsung can push during what they did with the S20 Ultra and we look forward to see more surprise feature from Samsung if you enjoy this video sub will be awesome thanks for watching and see you on my next video